Hey y'all, thank you for coming back to my channel. If you're new to my channel, welcome, welcome, welcome. If you're returning, thank you very much. Uh, I just wanted to step on here and give you an update about where I am now, eight months into this sister lock journey. So eight months in, where do things stand? So I was uh, sister locked, I had my install day, days, um, <laughs> April 17th through the 20th? Wait, 17, 18, 19, eight, through the 19th. Three days, two and a half days, whatever. Um, and since then I've been loving my locks, just enjoying this journey and really just excited to see what they're gonna look like in the future. So I'm going to just show you all where, where things are right now. I'm going to try to figure out how to turn around and, and zoom. So let me turn around real quick because I'm on a little, little cushion here. Woohoo! All right, turned around. So I just want to give you all a, a view of my locks from the crown down. Press on, hold strong. Don't turn away from me. Press on, we gotta move on to keep our love. You see, press on, hold strong. Shameless plug, the music you just heard, that's me. So make sure you uh, check out the link in this description box. Also follow me on El Nicole Music, on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter. Enjoy, you'll, you'll love it, trust me, you'll love it. If you like that song, you'll love the rest. All right, back to the hair though. So, like I said, eight months in, started with seven inches, seven and a half inches of hair. I'm not exactly sure where I stand right now in terms of length, but I don't think, it's too much long, well, it's not showing, it's not presenting as if it's longer. Maybe y'all can tell, make, tell a difference. Um, but what I do know from my loctician is that your locks will thicken up before they start to lengthen up. Thicken before lengthen, I, I don't know. My loctician um, changed my rotation. So you can see like on this one, it's thinner towards this section, right? Towards the end of it. But towards the top, it's thicker. I don't know if you can see, there we go, there we go. it's thicker. And that's because the rotation changed. Um, and it honestly depends on your hair texture, uh, but your loctician can determine if, if they wanna do a, four point rotation or a three point rotation. I went from a four to a three. And um, it, it honestly, it's a looser rotation. So it's gonna look a little bit thicker than, um, than a four point rotation that's, more, that's tighter. But I, I think that just depends on your hair texture. If you have a tighter curl, four, a four point rotation might be the best for you. If you have a, a looser curl, maybe three point, or I don't know exactly how that works, but talk to your loctician, they'll figure it out and determine which rotation is the best for you. I'm liking this three point rotation because I like the thicker, and I know my hair is getting thicker over time as well, but seeing the three point rotation as well is uh, it's pretty satisfying to see those results. But again, this is eight months. We're eight months in. I just had a retie a couple days ago. That's the only thing, I've been, I've been going every five weeks. Every five weeks I've been going to get my hair retightened. And I don't know if I'm ever gonna learn how to do that on my own. Maybe one day I will, I don't know. I'm gonna keep going to my loctician for as long as I can. Um, but eventually I think I do wanna learn how to retail on my own. Uh, it's gonna be down the road, way down the road, because I don't know if I have time or the patience to do it, but it kind of seems satisfying. I think that might be why some locticians enjoy it, it's because it just seems like a satisfying process of seeing 
you know, somebody come in with all this new growth and then you're just like, we in there. It's a lot. <laughs> you're back. All right. Um, but this has definitely been the best hair decision ever. And one thing that's pretty funny is when I was loose natural, couldn't figure out how to define my curls at all. Now that I'm locked, my little curly cues on the ends. Look at this. Would you look at this? A whole curly cue on the end. Where's another one? There's another one in here somewhere. Look at this one. I can't reach it. Where's she at? There she go. A whole curl on the end of my head. And I couldn't figure out to save my life how to, how to define my curls better, you know, when I was loose natural. And now I'm doing absolutely nothing and my curls at the bottom are, are popping. Now that is definitely where you'll start seeing some budding as well. Um, some of them have buds, most of them don't, but um, that's where you'll see budding and budding will indicate, hey, she's starting to lock. And once the buds come in, yeah, the locking is happening. So I don't know where you are in your journey. Let me know where you are in your journey, but I truly have been enjoying this lock journey. And um, whatever locks you have, I feel like for the most part, locks are freeing. It doesn't matter if you have more free form or palm roll or more traditional locks or, or sister locks or interlocks or, or micro locks, whatever you have, I feel like that whole locking process and just seeing your hair flourish is very freeing. Um, it's been freeing for me. It's been, a, it's been an amazing journey so far, and I can't wait to see where things end up a couple years from now. I'm excited. Press for the future. Let's go. We got this. Hey, hey. Anyways, go stream my music. Like my music. Follow me on different social medias. I'm playing, but no, do all that. Um, and let me know what you think of that too. Sure. All right. Y'all have a blessed one. Love y'all. Peace.